Hey guys, Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. So this is my brand new one step polish. The cool part about this is it's quite different than my current polishes because I'm a huge fan of water-based polishes. They work faster, they have a, a shorter working cycle. I just prefer water-based polishes. Not only do I like them better in performance, but they also, uh, the cool part about them is that they're safer to use. So uh, my polishes are VOC free and water-based generally. This product is actually water-based, or I'm sorry, is actually oil-based. The reason we did that with this new abrasive system is because I needed a polish where I could polish outside in the sun, in the hot Florida sun, occasionally. I don't make it my practice to paint correction outside, but when I need to, I need to, period. Just gotta make that money. So, with that said, I have my DeWalt polisher here. Uh, this is the cordless deal. There's a five inch, obviously orange, uh, buff and shine foam pad here. I got two piece size dots. The pad is already primed. If you'll come over here and take a look at the surface with these LED lights, you, if you move around there, Tony, you can really get those scratches. There's tons of scratches in that quarter panel. Um, come over here. It's going to be real hard to get them on camera because of the lighting, but you can see there's scratches throughout this panel. It's hard to see because of all that metallic, but here we go. Let me show you a polishing cycle. Now, traditionally, you would have to work an oil-based polish longer to break everything down. But with our advanced um, abrasive system that we've custom built to break down at a faster rate than most oil-based polishes, uh, you'll notice that this polish works great, uh, very fast, and wipes off really easy. Now, I will be doing more demos for you guys in direct sunlight. It's gonna be about 70 degrees today. It's overcast, it's hard for me to get outside, but I also am doing a newer car that doesn't need a ton of polishing. But uh, for two P-sized dots, you can literally do this whole rear quarter panel. So here we go. Um, how I generally do it is I'll push it around like that. I don't spread it around the whole panel. I let the polisher do all that. So here we go. Um, I also, my buffing cycle is the same with this polish as it is with my water-based polishes. I do three passes for a section pass, wipe, dunzo. And that, as they say, is that. <clears throat> now, check out how easy this is to wipe off. So, <clears throat> it's well broken down. Check this out. One push. Pretty easy.
I like to go over the panel like this and get the bulk off. Then I'll fold it in fours and soften up my pressure with this. And then just give it a quick wipe to remove any final residue that it might have. Now let's inspect this paint. Right off the bat, I can notice that it is much glossier. If you come around here and look right where the, the, uh, the light is, you can see even in the metallic that those scratches that I referred to before are mostly gone. No more haze, super glossy. This thing looks awesome. I've literally painted this entire side or painted. I've literally polished this entire side so far and it looks much glossier just visually. Not even, I mean, see how muted this side looks? It's all clean and clayed and prepped and ready to go, but it just, it lacks, it has a haze that this size, side just does not have anymore. So look forward to March 1st, 2024 peeps. My new one step is gonna be live and ready to roll. So let me know if you've got any questions, but I will be sure to get you some really good shots in the sun, in direct sunlight, with a temp gun and all of that. So I'll give you a proper demo of what this polish is made for uh, very soon. As soon as I have an opportunity to do that, uh, it will absolutely be really soon because this uh, we're less than a month away from launch. So thanks for watching, guys.